everyone, welcome back, Lions. I speak for everyone in Lions Nation when I say we are pumped to have all of our Lions students and staff back in the den. Welcome to the first episode of the Lions Prize New Network for this new school year. I'm Cadet Ensign Catherine Suarez. Today is Friday, September 24th, and this is the Lions News. Attention all GHS students. This Monday, September 27th, is Picture Day here at GHS. All pictures will be taken during gym classes on Monday. Remember Lions, all GHS students, grades 9 through 12, will have their picture taken for the yearbook and or student ID cards. Students who would like to purchase pictures must have their money and a completed envelope at the time pictures are taken. Stop by the main office if you have any questions or need more information. All of us here at the Lions Pride News Network are stoked to be back at the home of the Lions and working in our state-of-the-art studio. We have an excellent news team this year, and we look forward to bringing you all of the exciting news and events to everyone in Lions Nation. Be sure to check out and subscribe to the GHS Live YouTube channel to stay up to date on all things Lions. What's going on Lions? Cadet Chief Kevin Brecko here with some exciting news for everyone in the Lions Nation. As you know, this week was campaign week here in GHS. We here at the LPNN want to give a huge congratulations to all of the candidates. From impressive speeches to creative campaign posters, these lines were nothing short of phenomenal. Stay tuned to the end of the day to hear the election results. Best of luck to you and all. So, go Lions! All of us here at the LPNN and everyone in Lions Nation would like to congratulate and thank all the GHS students who participated in last week's St. Patrick's Parade. The parade was led by the GHS ROTC Honor Guard and included members of the GHS Honor Society and Lions football team. Thank you to all the Lions who are part of this wonderful tradition. We want to give a big shout out and congratulations to the following members of the GHS ROTC program who received promotions this week following their first uniform inspection of the school year. Both Andrew Pinto and our own Catherine Suarez have been promoted to the rank of Cadet Ensign. Congratulations to both of you and as always, Go Lions! What's up Lions? As you know, we're in the midst of Hispanic Heritage Month and we turn our first spotlight to one of the most beloved Phillies players in history. Carlos Ruiz. Ruiz was born in Panama on January 22, 1979. At the age of seven, Ruiz's father, a police officer, died in a car accident, and Ruiz started working on a coffee farm to help his mother. It was this tragedy that drove Ruiz to fill his dream of playing in Major League Baseball to help support his mom and two brothers. In 1998, Ruiz attended the Phillies Baseball Academy and was signed by the Phillies that December. After nearly a decade in the minors, Ruiz made his big league debut on May 6, 2006, and by 2007, he became the team's starting catcher. For the next nine and a half seasons, Ruiz was a constant behind the plate. He caught four no-hitters with the Phillies, including Roy Holiday's perfect game and his no-hitter in the playoffs. Ruiz had many other memorable moments, including a game-winning hit in the 2008 World Series and catching that final out. From fans yelling, Chooch! Every time he stepped up for an at-bat to being the heart and soul of the Phillies' most successful period, Carlos Ruiz is one of the most beloved players in Philadelphia sports history and easily the greatest Latino ball player in Phillies history. Stay tuned for all of our future broadcasts as we continue to spotlight the impact and contributions of other, of other legendary citizens of Hispanic heritage. Attention any GHS students interested in auditioning for this year's play, Clue. Auditions will be held on Wednesday, September 29th, right after school in the auditorium. This year's play is a comedic murder mystery spinoff on your favorite childhood board game. Auditions are open to all students, grades 9 through 12. No experience or preparation is necessary. Just stop by the auditorium right after school on Wednesday. Any students interested in becoming part of the stage crew for this production should fill out the stage crew application in the Theater Club's Google Classroom. You can email Mrs. Charles if you have any questions or concerns. All right, Lions, that's going to do it for the first episode of the 2021 through 2022 school year. We look forward to bringing you everything you need to know about all of the exciting events here at GHS. Make it a great weekend, and as always, go Lions!